ETFinalScore.com has East Texas high school sports covered. And now you can take it with you. Get the latest scores from Friday Night Football, articles and videos. Focus in on Dotney photo galleries and more. So don't miss a thing and get your ETFinalScore.com app today. Good afternoon from the CBS 19 newsroom. I'm Jillian Sheridan. And I'm Anthony Austin. Are you ready for some high school football? The heat is not going to keep fans away from the start of East Texas football season tonight. But before you start tailgating, it's a good idea to take a few safety measures. We'll tell you how to stay cool tonight at 6. Tyler Mayor Pro Tem Martin Hines announces his intention to run for mayor in the May 2014 election. Current Tyler Mayor Barbara Bass is not seeking re-election due to term limits. Hines is a Tyler native who is also a small business owner and property manager and investor. Prosecutors are moving forward with their case against a Tyler man accused of killing his wife and kidnapping his son. 42-year-old James Calvert's computer data was turned over to his defense team during a hearing this morning. Prosecutors also told the court that some blood spots on Calvert's clothes were so small they can only be tested once. Wood and Cherokee counties are now under a burn ban. Wood County's ban is for 90 days. According to Wood, all outdoor burning is prohibited. The U.S. Department of Agriculture has named Cherokee County a primary disaster area because of the extreme drought conditions affecting that area. Ladies in Van Zandt County, a reminder to keep your purses and handbags on you at all times while shopping. Constable Henson says there have been recent reports from several women of their purses being taken from their shopping carts. Join us for all that plus weather and sports tonight on KYTX CBS 19 News at 5 and 6. And visit us anytime online at CBS19.tv.